I'm Steve Johnson. You probably don't know who I am, but if you like monster movies, you might. Here's what we're going to do with this channel. I've got what I consider to be a treasure chest. It's, it's an archive of a 30-year career, my career in the film industry. I've done over 200 movies, and I've got 100,000 still photographs, over 10,000 hours of behind-the-scene footage that's never been seen. I mean, it range, ranges from Videodrome, Poltergeist 2, Big Trouble in Little China, Ghostbusters, Spider-Man 2, Cat in the Hat, even Where the Wild Things Are. Uh, and what I want to do with this channel is I want to share what I consider to be a treasure chest of glory, of archives. It's a tribute to the art of special makeup effects. It's a tribute to the artists that created these things for the movies that we all love. Because I've kind of separated myself from the industry because my contribution to the film industry in, at this point is over, I feel like I've got a responsibility to share this stuff. And uh, I'm thrilled to be in that position because it's stuff that in so many cases the archives, the behind the scenes footage, it's better than what you saw in the movie. And in many cases, it was not even seen in the movie. And so many people worked so hard to create this stuff. So many artists got together. So many mountains were climbed. So much blood was spilled. So many tears were cried that I just feel fantastic to be in a position now, finally, to take this responsibility upon myself and have a group of people that can put this YouTube channel out and share it once and finally with the rest of the world. Stan Winston died last year. At the rate I'm drinking and smoking, I'll be dead before this first episode is out. <laughs> you know, Rick Baker's getting older. The fact is, once we all pass, who's gonna pass the baton on then? So that's what I think is so cool about this opportunity, to put it down in pixels for everyone to be able to appreciate, enjoy, and respect. All of this stuff coming from my career, my 30-year career in the film industry. And, you know, I, I started way, way, way back in probably 1978 working with people like Rob Bottin. He's got one Oscar. Total Recall. They just gave it to him for creating the makeup effects because the effects were so good, they didn't even bother to challenge it. He just got one. There you go. Uh, Rick Baker, he's got eight Oscars now. Greg Canham, he's got three or four. It doesn't even count. After you have two Oscars, who cares? It doesn't count. Richard Edlund, I did several films with him. He's got eight Oscars. Everybody that I've ever worked with has a closet full of Oscars. I don't have any Oscars, but I have a lot, a lot of stuff I'm going to share with you. What I do have, though, I have an Emmy. The funny part about this Emmy is I actually won two Emmys, but I lost my other one. I don't know where it went. That's actually, I think, better than having two Emmys is to have two and then have actually lost one. So this is what you're going to find. It, 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 it's just going to be a blast because we're not, just showing off the archives. We're not just showing you how we did this stuff. We're going to bring the original artists and the original filmmakers back into this picture because they want to do the same thing I'm doing. I know they want to share this stuff with you guys. So we're going to bring everybody back to the table and we're going to talk about how this stuff was created. We're going to talk about the passion and the art that inspired these movies and these effects. And we're also going to allow you, the viewer, to ask questions. It's gonna be a totally interactive thing. It's gonna be unlike anything you've ever experienced and I'm just so pleased to be able to present this.